Om Sum was out for a walk on a cold winter morning. As the chilly wind brushed past his face, he felt his body tremble. His teeth chattered and tiny shivers ran down his arms. Surprised, he wondered, why do we shiver? Determined to find out, Om Sum shrank and entered his own body. Om Sum landed near the muscles. They looked restless, twitching in short bursts. The brain had sensed the huh? drop in body temperature and commanded the muscles to contract quickly and repeatedly. Om Sum held on tightly as the muscles began to shake all around him. The rapid contractions made the whole body vibrate. With every tremble, Om Sum could feel warmth spreading huh? through the tissues. The shaking wasn't random. It was the body's way of generating heat. He followed the nerve signals back to the brain and saw what was happening there. The hypothalamus, the part of the brain that controlled body temperature, was sending signals to the body to start shivering. The quick muscle movements used energy, and that energy turned into heat, helping the body warm itself. Om Sum looked around in wonder. The more the muscles shivered, the more warmth filled the air. Slowly, the temperature began to rise again. Leaping back outside, Om Sum smiled proudly. <laughs> Om Sum was at the park when his friend slipped on a banana peel. The scene looked so silly that Om Sum burst out laughing. He laughed harder and harder until suddenly he noticed tears rolling down his cheeks. Surprised, he wondered, why do we cry when we laugh? Determined <laughs> to find out, Om Sum shrank and entered his own head. He reached the place huh? where laughter was controlled. Nerves were firing like bright sparks, sending waves of joy across the brain. As Om Sum laughed harder, his chest muscles tightened, pressure rose in his head, and the swollen blood vessels pressed against the tear glands the tear huh? glands could not hold back anymore. They spilled out tears, even though Om Sum wasn't sad at all. Om Sum tried to block the tear glands with his hands, hoping to stop the flow. But with a sudden burst, tears spilled out again. Huh? Om Sum staggered back. The pressure was simply too powerful. Then, Om Sum finally realized the truth. Huh? The pressure was actually being built by his own brain. The brain was getting overloaded from too much laughter. It sent out mixed signals, the same ones used for crying. Those signals pressed on the tear glands, and tears spilled out even though he was happy. Om Sum floated back out. Smiling proudly, Om Sum now understood the mystery. Om Sum was lying on the grass one night, staring at the starry sky. <laughs> Among the twinkling lights, he remembered hearing about something mysterious called a black hole. It sounded like a hole huh? in space that swallowed everything. He wondered, what exactly is a black hole? Curious <laughs> to find out, with a magical flash, he reached right in front of a black hole. It looked invisible at first, huh? but a glowing disk of gas and dust circled around it, shining brightly as it spun faster and faster. He drifted even nearer and saw the invisible boundary around the black hole. Scientists called this <laughs> the event horizon. Anything that crossed it, light, matter, or even entire stars could never escape. Suddenly, the pull of gravity tugged at Aum Sum, drawing him closer. As he struggled, a vision unfolded before his eyes. Far in the past, huh? a massive star burned brightly, then used up all its fuel. With nothing left to hold it up, the star collapsed in on itself. It shrank smaller and smaller until its entire mass was squeezed into an incredibly tiny, heavy point called the Singularity. The collapsed star was what became the black hole in front of him. Then, with a burst of energy, Aum Sum pulled himself back into open space. 
smiling proudly <laughs> as he now knew what a black hole was.